What do you think Tuesday is going to be like? I don't know, actually. Um, we've had homecomings before, but nothing like this with the um, level of impact and <clears throat> the brand of play in the Bay Area is something that I don't know if any word I, or way I explain it will do it justice. We obviously have a game to play, so you want to make sure you're locked in mentally on that, but he deserves um, the celebration and the, the, the welcome that he's going to get. And then, like I talked about before, it should be a great opportunity to reflect on all the memories that we had. I don't want to be too crazy where it's not, it's not a you know, memorial or like a vicious, like, I'm still talking about basketball and life, but I want to enjoy the moment of you know, getting the celebration that he deserves. And however it plays out, uh, I just hope he feels the love. I think just good momentum and not trying to ride the emotional roller coaster of people declaring who we are as a team too early. It doesn't really matter. It's just win games and build that identity as you go. Uh, I think. Houston and DC, those are games you probably say we should we should win in Boston, Cleveland, OKC, it's we understand they're the best teams in the league and have been for, you know, South Cleveland like a couple of years. And so you go in with the idea that if you play sound basketball, you should be able to win. You go two and one in that stretch and it's great. So I don't think it matter who what how the games were to fall on if you said four and one on the road trip get on the plane leaving San Francisco to go take that in a hot second and get back home. So excited about, you know, continuing to build momentum. I remember last year how, you know, we had a, a good start and then the wheels fell off a little bit. So we're going to keep pushing in the right direction we're doing that.